I'm back in the bottom stand this evening. It's probably about 3.30. And uh, it's it's warm, 55, pretty stiff wind blowing. I've probably not been over here in the evening time. And sure, I don't know. It's been a month and a half, maybe. So uh, anyway, we're hoping that they'll come out tonight feed in these beans that's standing and uh, there's some rye grass growing up underneath it <clears throat> it's still possible very possible to find them cruising around chasing you know East Tennessee Upper East Tennessee uh, that that goes on sporadically for several weeks so Get settled in here and see what happens. crashing. I think I just heard him crash right in here. Whew, man, my back's are killing me. Oh gosh, I'm torn to pieces. My wind is blowing straight up this hollow. Kind of northeast. And then heavily north. Well, all summer they've been, when I would hunt in the evening time, I'd see them come out of there, but I thought I'd take a chance on it because I've been noticing the last couple times I've hunted down here, the deer have been moving over into that thicket over there. So I thought, well, if they're bedding over there, I might get a chance. And I mean, here they come. I saw one doe running, and then he just steps out. Some does come with him and he comes right to the bean. Alright, well, not much tracking on this one. He made it to the edge of the field and uh, piled it up so this ought to be easy dragging. <laughs> 